In this video, I want to go over simplifying uh, numbers in third form. So, so the question is: say simplify, simplify. So, the question is: say three plus root seven divided by 3 minus root 7 minus 3 minus root 7 divided by 3 plus root 7. Now when you have this and this, this is called a third form and we want to simplify it. So when you're simplifying, uh, frac this is basically a fraction in a third form. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply I want to make the denominators equal. So, well, what can I do? I'm going to multiply this first fraction by root the numerator by 3 plus root 7. If you look carefully, that is the denominator of the second fraction. So, as I multiply the numerator by 3 plus root 7, I should multiply the denominator by 3 plus root 7. I just multiplied by basically 1. So now you can pause the video and try to do the rest if you can. So for in the next bracket, sorry, in the next uh, fraction, we need to multiply by the denominator of the first fraction. So this is 3 take away root 7 times 3 take away root 7 divided by 3 plus root 7 times 3 minus root 7. So now I'll pause the video and try to do the next step if you can. Hopefully you should have done this step. So basically you're multiplying the two brackets. So 3 times 3 is 9. This is 3 root 7 plus 3 root 7 is 6 root 7 and root 7 times root 7 is 7. So I put this in the bracket same way and the denominator is 3 you can use the formula of a minus b times a plus b so that is 3 squared take away root 7 squared which is 9 take away 7 and same way you can expand this you will get this. So let's simplify this further. So 9 plus 7 is 16 plus 16 plus 6 root 7 divided by 2 minus this is 16 minus 6 root 7 divided by 2. So now, so if you simplify this further, so you can divide both of them by 2. So this is 8 plus 3 root 7. Let's put this in the bracket, take away. 8 take away 3 root 7. Now if you open the brackets, so this is 8 plus 3 root 7 minus 8 plus 3 root 7. Now this is where you have to be careful and uh, this and this gets cancelled. So the final answer is 3 root 7 plus 3 root 7 which is 6 root 7. Okay now just for practice let me write one example. Uh, you can make up your own example like this. So this is a 4 plus say root 5 divided by 4 minus root 5 minus 4 minus root 5 divided by 4 plus root 5. So that is basically the same process. Try to do this yourself. So you can make up your own numbers uh, and uh, simplify. And you can also check this on your calculator. I'll pause this. And so this answer, this is 6 times root 7. You can confirm this on the answer on your calculator. So I'll show you how uh, to do that on a calculator. Okay, now if you want to check this answer on the calculator, so let me get my calculator. So, so we know the question, so we can go to run menu, menu run. So, so let's 
put the answer in the calculator. So 6 shift root 7 equal 15.87. Okay, so the answer in a decimal form is 15 root 15.9 or 15.87. So how can we do this on a calculator to check whether what we have done is right? Okay, so let me, oops, okay, so that's fine. So start with the bracket like this, so 3 plus shift root 7 divided by 3 minus shift root 7. So that's the first fraction. Take away 3 minus shift root 7, close the bracket, divided by open bracket, 3 plus shift root 7. And the NCA level 3, these questions are achieved level questions, so you should be able to check your answer. And this is 15.87, so your answer is, answer is right.